Hello, friends and strangers and everybody in between. I am Heli and this is my channel Gentle Gaming for Wellness. And in this video, I am taking you with me into Metopia. As a non native speaker of English, I feel that both my gameplay and my commentary will be better in quality if I do the post commentary thing and therefore get to focus on them both individually rather than trying to do them both at the same time. So that's what I'm doing and with that said, let's get started. Alright, here we are back at the inn and um, when I logged in, before I started recording, I got a letter which is um, apparently like a daily login bonus for this game and attached to that letter were three game tickets. Now, game tickets are used here in the arcade. You can win all sorts of stuff um, playing the, the Wheel of Fortune, the roulette, or you can play rock, paper, scissors, but I never do that. I never play the rock, paper, scissors game because it is completely random whether you win or lose and if you lose, you just lose the money that you put up uh, for the game. So, yeah, that's how you use the game tickets. Okay, HP Bananas and MP Sweets. So, HP Bananas and MP Sweets are precious, precious snacks that can recover your stats. They're always stored at inns. Your team will grab whatever snacks they can get their hands on when on the road. When you get to an inn, any extra snacks you have will be placed in storage. Don't worry, they'll never get thrown away. Alright, let's get going. Some new paths opened up. And last time we saved Backman's face, so let's go see that he's okay. Seems to be. Oh, is my face back on? Phew, that's a relief. Sticking a poor fella's face on a monster. Who'd even do that? Anyway, thank you. 200 gold. Yes, please. Let's go see this Nintendo fan person. Hi, hello, I'm Mariko. Would you say you're a Nintendo fan? Well, um, sure. Yeah. Yay! Me too, I'm a huge Nintendo fan girl. So, I've heard of these figures you can get. They're called Amiibo. I wonder what they look like. If you have one, would you mind showing it to me? Well, I don't have any amiibos, so can't show any. Let me know if you happen to get hold of any. I will. Alright, let's continue our adventures.
This fight should be easy. They don't even need to heal. Got some butterfly honey. Look, that cloud looks like a looks like a slime jelly. Oh, I can't speak today. Looks more to more to me like a juicy goblin ham. Ah, mmm, so hungry. Okay. Slow down. Let's take the easy path first. We'll come back for the uh, tough path. Alright. Ooh, first show off. Find a potion bottle. Bottoms up. Smells kind of funny. I mean, we always drink the potions we find. Mmm, tasty. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Um, better not think about that on second thought. A solitary rock moth. This really is the easy path. Alright, got our relationship up a bit. Ooh, doorbell. Someone's at the door. <laughs> ho ho ho, seems you've got company. Who is it? It's a new team member. Defeating the Dark Lord would be difficult with only two of you. So I called a new team member to come and join you. Give them a warm welcome. Okay, so... It's kind of obvious that since our first team member was Mario, our second one is going to be Luigi. And Luigi is cautious. And his job is going to be the mage. Deal stupendous damage, blasting away enemies with magical might. Luigi, the cautious mage. Okay. Nice to meet you. I'm Luigi, I'm a mage. I'm looking forward to traveling with you. That's nice. Be sure you make Luigi feel welcome to the team. By the way, I thought I'd called another member. I wonder what became of them. Hmm. Well, I'm sure they'll show up eventually. For now, you're a party of three. Ho ho ho! Alright. 
for now, Luigi is gonna stay by himself. I wanna get to level 6 friendship with Mario. And right off the bat, a new robe for Luigi. And obviously green is his color, so we'll equip that. And no buying bananas. Let's try the two star goblin ham. Oh, you didn't like that either. Butterfly honey. Luigi likes it too. So we all like it. Let's give Luigi the second one as well. Get him one bonus MP. See what's in the arcade? Squeaky stuff. Sure, that's a good enough chance. I hope. Yes. All right, squeaky stuff acquired. That's for me. And hopefully it'll do more, do more damage than the stick. Okay, so let's get going and also take Luigi with us. And this time we'll take the tough path. I think the three of us should be able to handle it. Luigi's first battle. He's still level one, so the only thing he can do is whack the enemies with his um, pointy stick. Mario Land Jump Slash, leap into the air and slice down to strike an enemy from above. And that attack uses his MP. As you will see in a bit. Alright, tough path. Goblins. Cautious warm up. Yeah, I was thinking I should probably heal Luigi. It's nice that healing people will um, improve my relationship with them. So it's kind of like a double benefit. Helps them stay alive for longer and improves their opinion of me. First warning. Nice. Always nice to avoid taking damage. Luigi with the double damage after warm up.
All right, Marion Island concern. Console a friend after they after they've taken a hit. Land fire. Toast a single enemy with mystic fire magic. So the damage he does with his fire spell depends on his magic stat. More money, always appreciated. And found an inn. Someone in the team has reached relationship level 4 with another team member. That would be me. Ah, oh, Luigi wants to get acquainted with Mario. Let's make that happen. Bought a present. I uh, got this for you. I hope it's okay. Ooh, gimme, gimme. What is it? A glass ball. Mario is kind of happy. Okay, so a little relationship boost. Oh no! I'm jealous. Ah. Okay, let's get me and Mario back together for just a couple more friendship levels. <laughs> Nobody likes that. Well, I mean, there's kind of no point in feeding the goblin ham to me or Luigi. And Mario doesn't like it. Alright, a new broomstick for Luigi. So yeah, I'm saving the ham for now. For some future party member. Getting myself some new robes or vestments. It is so difficult to choose between all these colors, but um, I'm going with the orange. Kind of matches the rest of my outfit. Nothing interesting in the arcade. Let's go. Well, look who it is. You just keep turning up like a bad penny. Dark Lord Boo. Prepare to taste defeat. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Well, since you won it so much, let's dance. Um, hold it right there. Who dares? A great sage, a wise and powerful mage, who roams the world helping others. For this role, I kind of have a couple of candidates. So, I was sort of thinking Yoshi would be adorable as the great sage, but then... 
the bubum. Well, um, the moustache just won me over. So, great sage, big bubum. Hmm, isn't he adorable? So, you're this dark lord I've been hearing so much about. You won't be getting your way for much longer. Not if I have anything to say about it. Didn't anyone ever tell you nobody likes a party pooper? I might just let you live this time. Bye for now. And breathe. How do you do? They call me Big Babom. I'm a traveling mage. I'm Heli. Intriguing. So, you're on a quest to defeat the Dark Lord? Yeah, but... But you feel you're not strong enough. Hmm. I sense a strange power within you, though. You might not think it's much now. But continue your journey and you'll go from strength to strength. So, just hang in there. Got it! If fortune is on our side, we'll meet again. Until then... Thanks for the encouragement, great sage Bobom. Ooh, the castle guards. Now, I have a sort of a vision for the uh, folks at the castle. And um, you'll probably figure it out once you see who I choose. So, the serious soldier, whether royalty or a hill of beans, he'll defend it with his life. For this role, I'm choosing the piranha plant. I mean, it's just adorable. Alright, lax soldier doesn't mind slacking off. It's greenhorn for crying out loud. And for this role, uh, I'd like thwomp, but um, I really don't like the way this thwomp's spikes go sort of through the helmet. Even though this thwomp is more like the thwomps I've seen in the games, uh, I'm still choosing the blue one because, yeah, it doesn't have spikes that stick through the helmet. All right, left royal support. Eternally loyal to the king, but a bit too set in his ways. So, for this role, <laughs> you will see. For this role, I'm choosing Goomba. He is adorable. These all are. Right royal support. He looks like he's trying hard, but really, he couldn't give a monkey's, well, um, you know what. And for this role, I have the shy guy. All right, so these are the castle guards and we will see them much later in the game. Or we will like properly meet them much later in the game. I mean, we already saw them. I wonder who that great sage Big Babom is. How cool was he? You won't be getting your way for much longer. Not if I have anything to say about it, right? Even Boo couldn't come back from that tongue lashing. So cool. 
<laughs> yeah, he is pretty cool. And also kind of adorable. Alright, let's check the right path first. Ooh, is that a new outfit? You look super snazzy. Why, thank you. All right, the Cumulus is a healer. So, I'm trying to take him out first. This is adorable. Oh. <laughs> this game is... Uh, well, it's always so adorable and it always gets me in a good mood. So, yeah, I love playing this game. And as you can probably tell, um, this is not my first playthrough of this game. I have my own private personal playthrough in which I have cast my real-life friends as my party members but obviously for entertainment purposes since you don't know my real-life friends um, it wouldn't be as interesting for you to watch them adventuring with me so for this play playthrough um, I'm choosing video game characters to come adventure with me. Alright, at the dinner table again. And unfortunately, we still don't have anybody to give all that goblin ham to. So, Let's see if Mario likes the one star ham. No. Dislikes that one also. So. That's a shame. Okay. Leather armor for Mario. Oh dear. So, yeah. They do sometimes get distracted and buy something other than what they should have bought. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Who do you fancy? What? I'm not telling. What? Tell me. Nope. Okay, I understand. Phew. Okay. And we also learned show off. But, um, let's get me back with Mario. And let's set off for more adventures. This time, we're taking the other path. Seeing what's over there. So left it is. Alright. This could be a bit of a long fight, See, seeing as the clouds are healers. Or not. 
<laughs> one down, one to go. But let's heal Luigi. Alright. I was wrong. It wasn't a long fight. Ah, what great weather for an adventure. Great weather for adventuring indeed. Yeah, what should we do? Let's go home. Yeah, let's... wait, what? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm with Mario, actually. I like to adventure at home. My home is my favorite place to be. Okay, cloud healing itself. But we did our damage. He's healing. Oh, this is cute. Luigi is feeling a bit down. Mario cheering him on, giving him some MP. And let's heal Luigi again. Oh, Mario needs some healing too. So, let's heal Mario. Alright, we learned praise. Shower a friend with compliments. And Luigi finished off the co goblin. And can I finish off the... no. It's not over yet, but now it is. Alright, Luigi leveled up. No new skills though. Game tickets, nice. Looks like someone wants to join your team. Alright. Now, this character may be familiar to some of you, but may not be familiar to, to others. Shantae, um, well, she's a sort of half genie girl, and, um, now, I know that uh, in the games, she's kind of, um, she's a very kind person and she kind of struggles with her self-esteem and, well, I was thinking that um, she has kind of matured a bit and toughened up a bit thanks to her difficult experiences and uh, yeah she's become a bit tougher 
and also uh, she has exchanged her fighting career for a pop star career <laughs> so uh, she has started to turn those difficult experiences of hers into into pop songs basically and I'm just kind of trying to choose between these two outfit types but I think the uh, dress is nicer for her So, Shantae, the cool pop star. I finally made it. Sorry I'm late. I'm Shantae, a pop star. I'll do my very best. Shantae joined our party. Yay! Welcome to the team. I'm sure we'll rub along just great. <clears throat> With that, we have a four-person party. Our journey has a very important goal. To save all of Metopia from the dastardly hand of the Dark Lord. And it's sure to be an arduous journey. So it's just as well the four of us have... Um... Hey... You done yet? We're hungry. Ugh. Toast to happy, harmonious and heroic travels. Bottoms up. So Shantae gets to stay with Luigi for now. And um, let's see here. Uh, yeah, we should try and get Barrio to buy that leather armor one more time. And this time he actually got it. Alright. So, yeah, red is his color. So let's equip that. And, uh... That was all we had money for. So Luigi wants to hang out with Mario, build muscles. All right, workout time. Acquainted, learn show off. Let's switch back. Eat some food. Cloudy floss for HP. Shantae likes it. How about me? I love it. And Mario. Mario doesn't like it. All right. What's at the arcade? Nothing interesting. Okay. Um, let's end it here for now. So, we'll continue from this point next time. So, if you like this video, please do leave it a like. And if you'd like to support my efforts here on YouTube, please subscribe to my channel, Gentle Gaming for Wellness. It's quick and easy and doesn't cost you a thing, but it does help me a lot. Thanks so much for watching. I wish you a lovely rest of your day and I hope I'll see you in the comments below.